My name's Errol Campbell. I'm from Purley, Surrey, and I'm here in Monaco to visit the Naked Dollar Technology Retreat. It's my first one. I've not been to one of these events before. And, um, and here I am. It's, and it's also my first time in south of France, Monaco. It's been absolutely brilliant in every aspect. The venue, the, the learning, the knowledge I've gained, um, the people I've met are all been first class and I can't fault it at all. My only regret, if I have one, is that I, I was encouraging my son to come over and I, he said to me that he was unable to and I should have really persuaded him more to have been here because I think he would have benefited from it at all as well. Well, I've just picked up so much learning, um, even at my old age. Um, I, I don't think it's too late to learn new things. I think um, all this, what I've learned, is going to put me in good stead to, to secure my future, um, to have a hope in my future also. And I think him being a young man, uh, he's working all the hours, doing his own business as a freelance uh, graphic designer and I would have loved him to have been here to, to learn and to find out that there's easier way to, to, um, to bring in a sort of secondary income. Definitely going to encourage him to, to come to the next one, get involved, do some research. I'm going to share the knowledge I have. I've taken lots of videos, I've taken lots of pictures, I've got um, the websites to, to, um, to impart on him and I really want to just encourage him to, to get involved. I think it's something that he needs to get involved with, my, my sisters, um, just our family generally and, and friends. I know I've been getting texts already from, from people back home saying that um, seeing some of the pictures and, and saying they want to know more about naked technology and how to get involved. So I'm, I'm quite excited about going back and sharing. I'm, I'm a full-time project manager in the um, mobile operators field. So I work for O2. I work all the hours God sends and then some, and, um, and I'm just looking at a way of getting out from the rat race, basically to secure not only my future, but my family's future, and my extended family's future. We've worked too hard over the years, and, um, and it's something I'm trying to impart on my family to, to look at other options to get involved with. On the first day, it was, it was, um, it was Marco, Marco Robinson. Um, he was t sharing with us at a very high level, which was fortunate for me because it's my first time I'm, I was learning about the business. So he was sharing um, information on and, um, Naked Technologies, the different um, business streams they have in terms of Big Love, um, Naked um, Dollar Exchange and also Naked Dollar. And um, he shared with us about uh, the, the idea of um, building your business, blockchain technology, how to best secure your wallets, and what to look out for in ICOs, and um, and just general knowledge on on blockchain technologies, which is what I which which is what I needed really. And on the second day, Mao came in and gave us a, a more detailed um, knowledge on how to create wallets, um, how to secure your funds. Um, how to encrypt your, your, your wallets and how to um, set up um, e-residency in Estonia, which is stuff which I wasn't, I wasn't aware of in any form or shape before. At the moment, your, your wallets are not secured, as I understand. There's different types of wallets. It's hard wallets, soft wallets, um, and warm wallets. And, um, and you have more, well, you have different options by setting up a, a, a bank account in Estonia as you do back home because um, as I understand, the banks in, in the UK have liberties and powers that we're not aware of and they control your bank accounts, um, so it's best to have options. I would love to find out more about Big Love. I'm very passionate about helping um, less fortunate people than myself. I'm quite involved in my local church and so from, from my perspective, I really want to find out how Big Love is going to work, not just to make money from, but really from an ethical point of view, I want to find out how um, Big Love can work as a charity. Um, and I'd love to get some of my church um, folks, um, colleagues, members to get involved with the, with the charity, with the Big Love concept, and so we can start home, helping the homeless. Totally fresh because I've not seen it in the, from what I've seen from um, crypto companies, 
there's nothing like this out there. It, um, it resonates with me for that reason, because we're helping the homeless. And also I see it as a way of, um, of getting the means to, to raise funds for our church. We haven't got a church at the moment, and we're having to, um, we're having to, to rent a, a building every month, which costs us over 1,200 pounds a month. And I, I really want to empower our members, church members, to get involved with this kind of business so we can start raising substantial amounts of money towards a proper, our own church, so we can start um, sharing the love and passing, passing that forward. One of the um, benefits is I've, I've met some really tremendous people, not just, normally when you go to these business things, I find that is you normally meet the Americans or you meet a few Europeans, but with this retreat, we've, I've met some wonderful people from different continents, um, and it's just been absolutely amazing meeting them, sharing knowledge, and networking with them, and and building a, um, a syndicate really, because we're going to be working together in in future. Um, looking forward to working with the likes of Balji and um, and just getting more involved and and helping one another and helping others in the process. You know, I'm just really grateful for the opportunity um, to, to come over here and, and enjoy myself and learn.